A piece of Rochester history has been restored. A clock dating back to the early 1900s has arrived at Rochester's new train station. 13 Wham's Matt Malloy has the story behind its century-long journey. So let us unveil the clock. Time has been ticking since 1914 on this clock. It first started counting the minutes at Rochester's Bragdon train station 104 years ago. The U.S. Naval Observatory would transmit a telegraph signal every day at noon. That would prompt this master clock, this very clock, to move its hands to noon automatically and send an electrical signal to the other clocks in the building to show the same time. Congresswoman Louise Slaughter's office helped track down the clock. They found it in the Mumford home of Peter Gores. For the last 45 some years, it's uh, kind of been a, a main part of our, it's always been hanging somewhere and running. Gores, a former railroad worker, was given the clock more than four decades ago. He returned it to be restored. That job went to Peter Shriver. You have to painstakingly take everything apart and restore all the wear issues, rebuild it essentially. The clock still has all the original mechanics, including a 15-pound pendulum. The historic timepiece now serving as a centerpiece in Rochester's new train station. I think it looks just great. I mean, it really, it's the right place for it. We have a brand new beautiful building with modern technology. And there's a testament to 104-year-old technology. It's still keeping time and has a place and, a, and serves a purpose in the new train station. In Rochester, Matt Malloy, 13 Wham News. The Bragdon train station in Rochester was demolished in 1965, but that master clock survived the demolition.